Hello everyone, how have you been? I want to show you something, just a moment. Look at these trees. I feel that true friends are just like trees. Trees give us oxygen and we live. True friends give us a reason to live. My Goji is back. She shared a fantastic presentation on today's word. Over to you, my lovely Goji, and thank you so much, my dear. Thanks a lot. Hello, Nilan. Hello, everyone. How have you been? I'm sure you'll remember me. I'm Georgia from Greece. And I have made quite a few guest appearances in Milan's amazing videos while she's presenting a new word in English every day. Um, I remember her uh, saying in one of her videos uh, how much discussion we had uh, every time we had to uh, decide on a new word to present. And while I was on my summer holidays, I used to text her and tell her, Hey Milan, I'm at a place which is very special. Would you like me to do a word for you? However, one day, despite my texting her, she was late at replying, so I couldn't uh, create a video while I was there. What I did was to create a video now with the pictures I had taken while I was at that place. Let's see the video and let's try to uh, guess the meaning of the word nemophilist. Yes, that's the new word for today, nemophilist. You have all seen forests and lots of trees and greenery and a park. And if you have guessed that Nemophilist has to do with forests and people, and yes, your guess is right then. Nemophilist is a person who loves forests, who is fond of forests. It derives from two Greek words. Nemos, an ancient Greek word, which means wooded pasture, and philos friend. So nemophilist means a friend of the forest. Milan, you can go on with giving more examples. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, my lovely Goji. Thanks a lot, my dear. I'm truly blessed to have a friend like you. God bless you, my dear. Whose woods these are? I think I know. His house is in the village, though. He will not see me stopping here to watch his woods fill up with snow. My little horse must think it queer to stop without a farmhouse near. Between the woods and frozen lake, the darkest evening of the year. He gives his harness bell a shake to ask if there's some mistake. The only other sounds the sweep of easy wind and downy flake. The woods are lovely, dark and deep, but I have promises to keep. And miles to go before I sleep, and miles to go before I sleep. Keep walking and keep learning. Stay blessed, stay safe. 